coronavirus cases are on the rise. It's most commonly referred to as the stomach bug, and an outbreak's happening right now all over the country. ABC Action News reporter Larissa Scott spoke with several experts. She joined us live now in studio to share some tips to avoid getting sick. You don't want to get this bug, Larissa. No, you definitely don't, Dia, and that's because this virus is extremely contagious and can take down entire households. That's why doing a couple of preventative measures can really help you avoid a rough couple of days. Health officials are tracking a norovirus outbreak in most parts of the United States, with data showing cases in the South are the highest they've been since last spring. Oh, it's rather very difficult to avoid it once it's around. and it gets in environments, it spreads to everyone. Try to isolate the person who has the, uh, the virus. The highly transmissible virus causes gastrointestinal symptoms that can get severe. And it usually involves vomiting, diarrhea, fever, stomach cramping. You can have all of those things. You can have one of those things. There's a lot of vomiting and diarrhea that can go along with this. Um, and oftentimes the individuals that have it do need some help, but if so, do not touch your face. Norovirus is not airborne. It's spread through your hands and surfaces. You can also get it from contaminated foods like shellfish, leafy greens, and fresh fruits. Norovirus can linger on objects for days and is most commonly spread in restaurants, cruises, and schools or daycares. So a very small amount of it can make a person sick. And so that's one of the major reasons why it spread so quickly. If you or someone in your family gets infected with norovirus, doctors say it's important to make sure they stay hydrated, especially kids. With norovirus, it's mainly supportive measures. You know, keep the child hydrated. If the child's becoming dehydrated, we need to know about it, bring the child to the uh, to an emergency room. Health officials say the best ways to protect yourself from this outbreak is by rinsing your fruits and vegetables, cooking shellfish thoroughly, and washing your hands often. Wash your hands with soap and water. And doctors really want to stress the need for washing your hands with soap and water more than you usually would right now because hand sanitizer it does not work against this virus.